Harry Gratian's death was announced by his former BBC Look North co-presenter Amy Garcia, who confirmed that he died on Friday, though the cause of his death has not been reported. Fighting back tears as she sent her condolences to Harry's family and friends, she told viewers that they will pay full tribute to the much-loved journalist next week. In a tweet, Look North's official account said, Our much-loved friend and colleague Harry Gratian died suddenly today. We are absolutely heartbroken to give you this news. Tonight our hearts go out to Harry's wife Helen, their children and all of Harry's family and friends. Mr. Gratian's wife, Helen, paid tribute to her husband, saying, He will forever be with us. She added, Our three boys and I loved Harry totally. We had an awful lot of fun with him and our home was his life. BBC Director General Tim Davies said, Harry Gratian MBE was an outstanding broadcaster and commentator. He had a real connection with the public who saw him as one of their own. Loved everywhere, but especially in Yorkshire, he will be hugely missed by his many fans and friends. Our thoughts are with his family at this difficult time. Jason Horton, acting director, BBC England, said Mr. Gratian was one of the true broadcasting greats. He was a natural on the television and on radio, adored by our audiences, especially as the trusted face of Look North and South today. He loved news, sport, his colleagues and fundraising for children in need and comic relief. Our thoughts are with his family, his friends and everyone across the BBC who he worked with. Tributes have since poured in for the broadcaster on social media as people paid tribute. Twitter user, at Purpolica's penned, Oh that's so sad, Harry was the face of my childhood. At Ethan commented, Poor Amy having to announce it live she was in bits. Country files Helen Skelton on night out with Judy Murray after split latest Christine McGuinness pals begged her to leave Patty admission Natalie Portman, 41, displays muscular figure and thigh skimming dress pictures, at Tony Sweeney added, an all-time Yorkshire legend. Shame he didn't have a well-deserved long retirement. Lots of fond memories of Harry. R.I.P. Harry, who was born in Bradford, began filing match reports for the BBC while working as a history teacher in the mid-1970s. While at the corporation, he reported on match of the day and grandstand and commentated on several Olympic and Commonwealth Games. Harry worked for the, the BBC from 1978 and had a career at Look North spanning almost four decades having joined the show in 1982. He presented the program for the last time in 2020. When he left the BBC in October of that year, the day before his 70th birthday, he said he had always lived the story. In 2013, his work in broadcasting was recognized when he was appointed MBE in the Queen's Birthday Honours List. He said the MBE was an overwhelming honor. Something I never thought would happen to me. For a lad born in a back-to-back -back in Bradford, I know my mum and dad would have loved to have been around for this day, he added, 